exist to be a guide for those who choose to be the exception. I remember this like it was yesterday. It was a defining moment. My family and I were in Tahoe skiing Heavenly Valley. I was uh, six years old. It was the end of the day and I couldn't wait to see my dad. I saw him at the bottom of the hill packing up my little sister's skis. I unclipped my skis and ran towards him. Dad, Dad, I said proudly. I skied by myself all day long and I didn't fall down one time. Without looking up, he simply said, well, then you didn't get any better. I stood there stunned. It was not the response that I expected. A few seconds passed and he looked up at me and said, look, Darren, if you don't push yourself past your current ability, then you can't grow. You have to fall to improve. Falling is part of getting better. I heard this over and over growing up. In fact, on our garage wall, which doubled as my dad's gym, painted in big black block letters was no pain, no gain. I owe much of my success to this philosophy. I became an entrepreneur at 18 years of age. I started like every entrepreneur starts out. I started afraid, nervous, and without a clue of what to do or what to expect. I had no prior experience, no training, and no guidance, except for that mantra. Falling is part of getting better. So I just kept falling. I got lots of skin knees, bloody noses, and repeated bruises on my pride and ego. But that's also how I improved and got better and eventually figured out how to do it right. 20 plus years ago, I fell into the personal development and success field of sorts. I was the executive producer to a television network called Success TV. That is where, in fact, I met and got to know and eventually became mentored by Jim Rohn and became friends with most every other thought leader that you can think of in the success industry. I've been at the center point of this industry ever since. I've now led three different television networks in this industry and have spent nearly a decade as the publisher and editor of Success Magazine. These respected platforms have given me unique and unprecedented access to study and interview and spend time with and present the stories of the most successful people on the planet. Incredible achievers like Richard Branson and Steve Jobs and Elon Musk and Jeff Bezos and Mark Zuckerberg, Howard Schultz of Starbucks and Steve Wynn, Jack Welch and many, many more. This exceptional 25 year journey puts me in a unique position to be a valuable guide for you. I've had to be the exception in every endeavor I've tackled. Nothing I've ever done I had done before. I was never trained or educated to do anything that I ended up doing successfully. I had to defy the odds. I had to be the exception. Through my own experience, I know how to, and I know how to show you. Additionally, no one has had greater access and spent more time investigating, collecting, and curating the best ideas, insights, and strategies on success from the most successful people of our lifetime than I have. It has not only been nearly 24-7, 365, my obsession, it has also been my business. You can say I've put in the 10,000 hours here so that you don't have to. And now I can give you the distillation, the summary notes of that exceptional 25-year journey, complete with action steps on how to multiply and significantly accelerate your success. I exist to be a guide for those who choose to be the exception, for those who want to go beyond and strive to be better, for those who are willing to learn more, grow more, invest more, and go for more, to do what others don't so they can live the life others won't. I exist to be a guide for those who seek to become all they can with all they've been given, for those choosing their better future to live the life they were meant to live. I exist for you if you choose to be the exception.